We first came across the teepees at an open day back in 2014 and it was just breathtaking from the minute we walked in and we fell in love with the space, the, the beautiful sort of canvases. My background, I, I was a, a joiner, fell in love with the timber and the natural materials. I can use that in the teepee business we've set up because we can make things bespoke for customers as we have done, haven't we? We certainly have. Um, so yeah, it does It does help on all the our tables and benches I've made and our teams have made. Um, we make the fire pits, we make all the, all the different items. Yep, yeah, some of the items that we've made so far do include a set of Lion, the Witch and the Wardrobe doors. Yeah. Um, we've also built a beautiful sort of rustic wooden arch. Yeah. We've got a lot more things to make as well, so we've got to keep an eye out on our brochure. That whatever your, your vision is and whatever you're, you're hopeful for, we can certainly sort of help you with it. The best thing about our wedding was being close to, to nature, being we was right on a, a lake edge, so we was we had beautiful, beautiful views. Um, and it was just being in within the teepees and obviously, you know, they, they just set a really good vibe. Um, you enjoyed it, didn't you? For me, I think it was seeing sort of people's um, surprise when we told them that the teepees actually belonged to us during the speeches. So that was a really special moment um, and sort of really made the, the rest of the evening absolutely superb as people were really sort of celebrating with us the new business and the wedding as well. The fact that we used the teepees for two very different purposes. In the morning we actually had our wedding ceremony with sort of benches set out in sort of church style if you will looking out over the lake which was absolutely beautiful and we created a, a wonderful aisle that I sort of came in through the back of the teepees past the open fire and greeted Matt down at the lakeside which was just superb. So all of our guests got to actually witness our ceremony whilst actually looking out over Lake Oldswater which was just beautiful. Um, and for, for us what that meant was we could then sort of change the TPs around so in the evening we had a completely different layout inside so guests came back to the TPs after a short break away from the test and it just it was just transformed really wasn't it one of the best things that hopefully Matt will agree um, was just the fact that we had a real sense of team effort and team spirit during the run-up to the wedding uh, Matt and the team had finished putting the teepees up by sort of end of the day on Thursday and our wedding was the Saturday so we had Friday to actually personalise the teepees and dress them in the way that we really wanted to. Over the next three years we've got really big plans for Teepee Unique. There's absolutely loads going on this year. We've, we've already got sort of bookings throughout the year, so summer right the way through into winter. And that's across a variety of events, so charity events, corporate dues, weddings, festivals. Um, you know, so the, the range of events that we're doing has sort of broadened since we started the business. So we're looking at sort of opportunities to bring on additional crew, um, to increase the number of teepees and hire accessories that we've actually got available to customers. We're really looking forward to actually sort of growing our awareness for the business and, and making sure that people know who TP Unique is and what we're all about and our, and our values really. No, I think it'd be good to expand and, and sort of take, take our business out to other countries and, and got to sort out the logistics of getting there but it's, uh, it's definitely a possibility and, and something we wouldn't uh, refuse. Absolutely love to take on a challenge of getting sort of like a teepee up the mountains or yeah. um, you know set one up on a, a beach in Hawaii somewhere or somewhere else exotic.